k-means algorithm partitions the data into k different sets. The algorithm consists of two steps, initialization and convergence of centroids. We will consider a k-means++ initialization algorithm and a standard algorithm of iterative refinement, Lloyd's algorithm. We will now partition these data points into three clusters. We start k-means++ by choosing the first centroid uniformly at random among the data points. Let's say we chose the first centroid to be at the leftmost data point. Each subsequent centroid will be chosen based on how far they are from their nearest centroid. Finding the Euclidean distances to the nearest centroid from each data point, we see that the bottom right data point is the most distant. The probability for a point to be chosen as a next centroid is evaluated by squaring its distance and dividing it by the sum of distances squared. Hence, the probability will be proportional to the Euclidean distance squared. Let us choose the bottom right as our second centroid. Finding the Euclidean distances to the nearest centroid from each data point, the data point at the top will have the most distance, so let's have the third centroid there. Lloyd's algorithm consists of the assignment and update steps. These are repeated until convergence. In the assignment step, each data point is assigned to the cluster of the nearest centroid. In the update step, the mean of the clusters are evaluated and the centroids are moved there. These steps are repeated until the centroids converge.